Hey, this is Jesse with Create This. I needed a HD camera for my little micro uh, quadcopter. This guy is my micro quadcopter. He's very, very small. And, you know, I just got, I got tired of posting videos with the SD camera and uh, I wanted an HD camera. So I knew about this board that came on the Hubson X4 H101C. It's called the H101C-A34. And it's a 720p uh, HD camera, and it's very light and very small. Uh, and so what I want to do in this experiment today is uh, I want to test it with 2S power. So you can see I've got this one here is wired directly up to a JST connector, right? So we're going to plug in this 2S battery directly onto that JST connector. Uh, this one here has a Palalu 3.3 uh, volt step-down regulator on it. So um, this one I've tested and it works fantastically. Uh, this one I fully expect to magic smoke, but um, I want to run the test anyway just to make sure that it does. Because if it doesn't, then I don't need the regulator and all the, all the better, you know, less weight. So here we go. Ready? Let's see the magic smoke here. All right, we got, we got lights. Press the record button. Yes. Nothing's happening with the record button. I don't smell anything yet, but it does not appear to be working either. Let's try doing that again. Okay, there's a red light this time. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that one's fried. So, and then we'll try it with um, the Palalu. Yes. You can hear my daughter in the background. So this is what it looks like with the Palalu. And when you hit the button, Oh, well, right. I need a uh, memory card in there, huh? All right. Okay, so there it is with the Palalu. We hit the button. And there we go, it starts blinking. So that one's working perfectly. And I'm guessing this other one is cooked at this point. Nothing dramatic. I was hoping to see like a puff of smoke or something, but I didn't actually end up seeing that. So I think what should happen is that red light should go away, which signifies that it's like ready to record, but it's just not going away. Now, I don't know if this board has over voltage protection. I'm guessing it doesn't. But it's possible that it does since I don't smell anything. In which case, I can probably power it up with 3.3 volt and it would be fine. But that's for another video. Hope you, hope you enjoyed that comparison. Oh, uh, one more thing. So, this is pretty cool. So I've got this little, uh, this is like a little sneak peek, uh, sneak peek here. I've got this little, uh, 3D printed enclosure bottom that I'm making for these things. And so this board just slides right in there and the camera seats down in the front just like it did on the original. I measured all of this with a caliper. Fits perfectly. Pretty cool stuff. Um, so I'm gonna make a, uh, a top plate for that to enclose it on the top, and this just keeps the little ribbon camera uh, pointed straight ahead. I'll probably make like another version with like a 30 degree angle or something. Um, and, you know, protects it from water and from impact damage and stuff like that. So, pretty light. Uh, let's see here. I don't know if you can see that or not, but Looks like about 
grams. Um, so pretty light and without without the voltage regulator or anything with the other one it's let's get that wire over there so that it actually weighs yeah so the other one weighs about 4.2 without the voltage regulator 4.2 grams so fairly light could maybe be a little lighter um, but pretty cool stuff either way so anyway uh, Thanks for watching and uh, please subscribe if you like this video.